Hello, hello, and welcome to Rory's Brainworks and this quick reference guide. Be sure to stay safe, sane, and consensual out there. Now, let's talk about X-Friction. Now, technically friction isn't a knot or a hitch, but it's also a very important part of rope bondage. When you look at these two spots right here, you have these areas that will cross over each other like that. That's X-Friction. And what that does is it shores up an area of ropes, making them a tighter bunch, making it uh, more secure, giving it a lot of structural integrity. And the particular way that you wrap it will create that integrity. Now, most of the time, you'll see X friction used on chest harnesses. You know, your Gote Shibares, you know, TK harnesses, if you will. That means to got to Gote. <laughs> As you can see, this rope is coming down this way and we'll go upwards and over and around. Make sure that's snug, and then we'll do the opposite from below, going above, and around. So we came from down and across above, over it, and from down, across and above, and over it. Now always make sure to compact by tightening down your X friction, and then you're good to go with the rest of the rope. X friction will hold something in place without creating a hitch or a knot. It's a way to preserve flow without adding a bit of clunkiness that sometimes hitches and knots will do. X friction is a powerful tool and a great one to have in your tool belt. It's beautiful and strong, just like you. Now bear in mind, all this information or what I have been taught or have observed over my experience. Well, hey, I hope that quick reference guide helped you out a little bit on your rope journey. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below to feed those algorithm gods. As always, I'm Rory. This is my brain. I'm fairly certain it works. Be safe and go create some art.